What's going on everybody? I thought I'd give you guys a tour of the makerspace, let you guys see how it's coming along. Over here we have the synthesizer and Wanda set up for playing and everything. I have not finished building the visualizer, which is in the works right now. I have fixed the hexaputer where it's on the thing, got all the lights on, got everything set up. It's all pretty much ready to go. I have added some new stuff to the mix. And overall, I'm really happy the visualizer is coming along. This is the second one. This is the workbench and everything set up. Just go kind of like a top down view, everything right. So starting here is like where my legs are, sew machine, got the workbench, fume extractor, like test equipment, whatever. Well, here we got a light. Check this out. Hey, let's go. How about that? Right? And then, of course, over here is where the sticker making stuff gets made, all the stuff that gets shipped out, and then uh, guitar stream, stuff like that. But anyway, so here's the thing. This project, this is the second board of the Wanda Visualizer. And the first board is, in fact, up under here. This is the other board. Quite a bit of difference in the, in the two, if you look at them. Well, there's an issue. It still doesn't work. So what am I going to do about it? I am going to do a perf board and do it a little hand by a bit. And in the meantime, check this, this time lapse out of it being built. What's up, you guys? I thought I would just share kind of a time lapse of how it went together. This actually did take five hours and 30 minutes, and then there was some testing at the end. It didn't even actually work. Um, for some reason, it actually took a step backwards, and it's the first time that's happened. And, you know, of course, as it goes, we just keep on chugging along and, you know, doing what we can. So what's going to happen next is just make the next one we're going to make v3 but we're going to do this one like kind of 70s 80s style and use wire wrap and do point to point and make sure this thing absolutely works and then we can always go back and update the schematic and you know boom we got it working right so yeah that was just something i wanted to share with you guys what i'm gonna do to save myself on more leds and not wasting any more i'm gonna take and wire wrap an entire grid of these leds one moment i'll show you that Take this wire wrapping wire and stick it in this little tool and there's a little hole here that you stick on the LED lead and wrap it around and it creates a really solid connection. You've wrapped it around a few times, you have a nice little solid connection and there's going to be 400 of these wires and this will prevent me having to redo the face panel and that will lock into this front grid and then I'm going to take some more of these perf boards like this up here and it's going to be like... Ah, uh, 20 of these. I'm going to build the channels on perf board like this and just do it one at a time because I want this to be guaranteed to work this time and not fail again. Well, because it takes so long, this was $80 per main board. Unfortunately, this whole project has been kind of like frustrating because it works like the single prototype works. And when it was moved to the 20 band prototype, it stopped working. So I'm just going to resolve the issues one channel at a time and do it perf board style. I really hope you guys are like into that type of stuff because I don't know. I think it's pretty cool. But anyway, I'm going to make it work. We're going to make it work. No matter what happens, it's going to get there. And like I said, I'm going to reuse one of these face panels and uh, do this perf board and make an LED panel that can just be reused using wires, this uh, wire wrapping wire here. And then, of course, it'll hook up to some external perf boards. There'll be like one for each of the channels or maybe one with all 20 channels. I'm not sure I'm going to do that yet. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I will see you on the next video. I'm not sure when that's going to be. But, yeah, hope you guys have a great day. Take care. Don't forget to stay hydrated. Love y'all.